Priceless damage has been uh, performed at one of Omaha's most popular spots for outdoor recreation. It's not easy to see it from a busy trail. So our Mike McKnight takes us into the woods next to Lake Zerinsky, and you might be angered by what he found. Trees are a wood picture frame around Lake Zerinsky, and a section has been chipped by vandalism. If you're out here enjoying the, the beauty, I don't think you would want to destroy it. On the side of a south hill, about 20 mature oaks and pines have been unprofessionally trimmed. Dozens of smaller trees and bushes removed altogether. In a swath about 50 yards wide, branches have been broken off and trunks indiscriminately sliced, leaving deep scars on some trees growing on public land. To call this a hack job might be an understatement. This tree gnawed at and there are teeth marks, but not from the bite of any animal. These appear to be machine made. A machine like this is suspected of causing the tree damage, but it doesn't belong to any government agency. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers tells me it's aware of illegal tree cutting at Zerinsky. The vegetation removal was not a sanctioned project by the city or the Corps. Yeah, people shouldn't be cutting trees with purpose out here, I guess if they're not authorized to. Omaha's Parks Director tells me the city investigation of this incident will continue to determine the right action. The park's manager calls it vandalism at its worst. And there shouldn't be anybody touching those that I know of. From the trail, it's hard to see how bad. Right up there, see how it's chopped up. But pointing out one marred tree gives walkers a glimpse of damage farther up the hill. It looks sad. Like somebody hurts the tree. I left messages for three homeowners at the top of the hill asking if they noticed the illegal tree cutting first discovered in December. So far, no replies. Lake Zerinsky opened in 1993, so many of the trees around here are 30 years old. Those illegally gouged and poorly trimmed may survive, but the vandalism left a sad mark on a scenic public place. On your side at Lake Zerinsky, Mike McKnight, 6 News. Anyone with information on the tree vandalism is asked to call the Omaha Parks Department or the Army Corps of Engineers. Not only is the damage a city crime, but also a federal offense.